Okay, so after having uh, installed a tomato onto a fresh uh, router, uh, we're going to show you how to install it onto a router that has DDWRT already on it. So this would be if you want to move from DDWRT to tomato, give it a try. Uh, basically navigate to your uh, router's uh, admin page. Um, you're going to need a, a build already downloaded of tomato. Um, so this one you do not need a trail build because you already have a um, custom firmware installed. So grab um, Tomato K26 USB 120RT MIPS SR2 128 and then the build of your choice, BTV, BMB, BM, whatever that we discussed in the previous video. So we've chosen the BT a build for this, so go to the administration tab log in with your username and password go to firmware upgrade select reset to default settings as we want to do that and then select the file to upgrade and then choose that um, <coughs> choose the firmware that you just downloaded not the trail to build but the um, full size build click open and then click upgrade and now we wait yet again So after that finishes uh, uploading and uh, rebooting, you'll have to hold the power button in on the router for about 10 seconds until the light changes color because you have to clear out just a little bit of extra uh, configuration that's normally in DDWRT, uh, specifically the username and password needs to be reset. So after that, you can connect to the default IP, which is 192.168.1.1. Um, I've had to change mine, as you can see, uh, before I could reconnect, um, as uh, I was, uh, I'm also connected to my own network. So um, once you've got this uh, up and running, then uh, you're all set. Thanks for watching.